Well, hello. Um, this is Gray again, of course. Uh, one of the things I get asked a lot is how to frame uh, shots. And uh, I'll tell you, it's the hardest thing I have when I'm training any new shooters is to how to get the, shoot, uh, the, the subject in the camera lens full frame. Uh, there tends to be fear and excitement when someone is running up on you. Uh, and they tend to take pictures too soon. So there's a trick that I use where I basically go into the settings on the camera and I turn on what's called crop mode, right? Um, I shoot with full frame uh, cameras, which a lot of people do. Um, what, what you can do is you can go in on those cameras uh, and I think on some of the others you can change the zoom ratio if you want to call it that. And what it does is it puts a box right on inside the uh, the lens, the lens piece, the the uh, the eyepiece, and then what you do is when someone is running up on you, you wait until they're inside that box, you know, like 80% full in that box, and it's just it's it's easier for you to do that. Now they they're further away from you, but that's another there's advantage to that because again, a lot of new shooters uh, they tend to pull the trigger when the when the uh, runners are too far away, and if you do have this crop box in there that will alleviate a lot of those problems or it'll reduce them okay so uh here in a second you're going to see an example of what i did at, at a race today and uh the video is not really great but it's because i was filming through the eyepiece of the camera but you can see as the runners are coming towards me i wait until they're in the box and when they're in the box large enough i take one or two or three pictures um and anyway i've done that a couple times so take a look at this and you'll see what I mean about filling the frame. And then I'll show you an example of one of those uh, pictures, uh, the still image of those, of those pictures, of how it actually came out. Okay? All right, so what you saw there was the same shot. I just ran it through three times. Um, of course, I was filming, like I said, through the IP, so it wasn't exactly um, smooth, um, but you can kind of get the idea. So I just waited until he came into the box, and then when he was about 80% in the box, I, I took a couple shots. So um, now if your camera doesn't allow you to do cropped uh, shooting like that, then what you'll have to do is when you're looking into the eyepiece, you're going to have to wait to take the picture until the uh, runner is 80% of the whole eyepiece, right? So you want to think to yourself, okay, do I have like a little bit above them, a little bit below them? Um, if th think of these as if I were to buy this image and I want to crop this into an 8x10, which the cameras are shooting really a 4x2, like a 5x7, that kind of thing. Uh, if you want to crop it into an 8x10, you need to have a little room at the top and the bottom. Not a lot, just like 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 a foot. Like if you look look at somebody like a foot above them and a foot below them, um, so you'd have to wait until till the uh, till they get to fill that frame. But if you can get a crops uh, uh, the cropped uh, a view on your camera, turn it on. You'll be glad you did. 